Hola a todos, bienvenidos al primer vídeo del Let's Play interactivo de The de Walking Dead. ¿Vale? Los que no hayáis visto el vídeo de introducción, os dejaré un enlace por aquí, más o menos. Para si queréis verlo, yo os recomiendo que lo veáis, ¿vale? Lógicamente, el que quiera verlo, que lo vea, el que no, pues no. Y deciros que no es un Let's Play comentado, ¿vale? Yo voy a estar calladito, voy a dejar a la gente que se meta en el juego tranquilamente y que lo disfrute sin estar yo interrumpiendo, haciendo comentarios ni nada por el estilo, ¿de acuerdo? Pues nada, pues empezamos. Espero que os guste. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. And what do you say? I say, yep, I know you didn't. I followed your case a little bit, you being a making boy. for making me. Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. I always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real shame, that is. Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. Any of that seem important to you? All of it, but that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on a six year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? Sure. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. You'll have to learn to stop worrying about things you can't control. I'm driving this man once. He, he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella. Big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you sit. 
Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. That's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Maybe he was innocent. Innocent? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. Watch out! This other time... <laughs> Officer, are you all right? I'm still cuffed back here. I need to drag myself out that window. Officer Shotgun is over there. Looks empty. It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. Officer? God damn. Shit. Holy shit! What in the hell? What the fuck are you? Get away from me!
Someone! There, there's been a shooting! Hello? Anybody? I'd fill one of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. No ladder. <laughs> I'm not getting up there anyway. This leg the way it is. Help! Anybody up there? I wonder if anybody's home. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Ah! Hello? I'm not an intruder. Or one of them.
hello? You need to be quiet. Who is this? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. You're not my daddy. No, I'm not. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. Did you kill it? I think something else did. Before me, I think. I heard her scream two nights ago. Maybe one of the monsters got her. Two nights ago? Yeah, that's probably what happened. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? Bueno, gente, pues hemos llegado al momento de donde tenéis que tomar vuestra primera decisión. ¿Vale? Estas son las dos opciones. ¿Vale? Os pondré yo los enlaces. Y elegís lo que consideráis que os gustaría más hacer o lo que vosotros queráis, ¿de acuerdo? Pues nada, muchas gracias, espero que os haya gustado hasta ahora y nos vemos en el próximo vídeo.